in this session i will show you how to connect uh, raspberry pi iot device to azure portal and uh, get some messages from the iot device so i am using raspberry pi as iot device here so so first step will be to log into azure portal then choose create a resource so azure is nothing but cloud provided by microsoft so they are providing all the hardware and uh, it server is already ready for you to use so there are several apis for uh, um, your raspberry pi device so you can connect your iot devices there so it will be useful in connecting uh, like in coming future everything will be connected to uh, raspberry or uh, other devices also so that's why we are calling it internet of things so each and every devices in each building or any other place like restaurant or any other place related to tra tour and travel so everything will be <coughs> connected to this these clouds so it's way it will be very useful so that uh, we'll get the status of all the devices and all the things <coughs> so that's why uh, that is the main agenda of this session so then create a resource so i have already logged in so you can log in using your uh, gmail or any other email id so just i'll click i have already created resource but let's create once again so the second create a resource and search the marketplace for the iot hub so search here iot hub and then create create button this is uh, iot hub free trial so make sure it should be free otherwise like uh, most of the people think that it will be charged yeah free trial resource group you and create the size and scale select the subscription to use your resource group you can create a new resource group region iot hub name to be located okay okay here make sure you select free tire only one free iot hub is allowed the right iot hub So let me delete this. already existing i am just deleting deletion in progress okay it's deleted so here now it will not task or
thousand messages will be there and then source group click next size and scale now what is retrieve connection string so retrieve the connection string Yes. Shared policies. Copy this in string primary for later use. So we'll put that in uh, while running our program so that it will connect to this portal. Register a new device in the IoT hub. Register a new device now. Register a new device. okay so just add So it will be auto generated, tree will be auto generated. Copy the connection string, okay. From here, you can copy. The device is created. Primary connection string copy. And I will post here, paste here for later use. Okay. Then what's the ne next step? Okay, so this is already there in my previous video like set up uh, raspberry pi you can search with raspberry pi uh, session one 
name lssh that i have already done so when you log into your raspberry pi you can see this screenshot and enable that connect to sensor so currently i will not use this in later video i'll show this uh, how to use connect sensor and all so i am skipping this section now so just connect to your raspberry pi device i have already connected already installed Okay, so you can simulate using this command actually. To get the simulated data. Anyways, it is customizable. Any uh, any sensor you can use and you can provide this in your program that will fetch. Because it will store the result in variable and it is uh, sending to the cloud. You can run any other program and store in that variable and send to the cloud. copied the connection string from here I just uh, clicked on IOT devices and then I got this so connect copy here and then provide after building this I just provide sudo app and then as argument in single quotes so this is the data which is being sent uh, no. Just check in the logs.
is sent to Azure IoT Hub. So, what was the connection? Mm -hmm. 